to optimize Windows 11 for faster performance. So in order to make your Windows 11 PC faster, the first option you can try out is go to settings and after you reach settings, go to the system option, scroll down and go to storage option right here and make sure to turn on the storage sense right here. So what this will do is it will automatically free up the space, delete temporary files and manage locally available cloud content. So you can turn it on and then you can go to cleanup recommendations right here. So after you do that, if you have any cleanup recommendations here, then make sure to apply that to your PC and that will make your Windows really fast. The next thing is go to advanced storage settings inside system storage right click on it and after you have done the following then go to your privacy and security option right here inside the settings right then go to general and what you can do is disable all of these options right here these are, are somewhat unnecessary so make sure that you disable all of these options and after you have done that go to your privacy and security option again and go to speech turn off the online speech recognition if you're not using the online speech recognition feature right here and after that go to your privacy and security again and go to inking and typing personalization here and make sure that you turn this off. So turning this off will disable to use your typing history and handwriting patterns. That might that might be one of the solution to your that might be one of the solution to your PC being a bit slow. So this is the option that you can try out as well. And go to privacy and settings again and go to diagnostics and feedback. And after you do that, then you can just turn off the send optional diagnostic data here. You can just turn this feature off. Do not turn this off if you have joined the Windows Insider program. That is the thing to keep in mind. The next option you can try out is go to your privacy and security again and go to your app permissions here. And just turn off the features that you don't need. For example, I'm not using my location service, so I I have this option right here turned off there are a lot of unnecessary options that you don't need so you can turn those off and the next option you can try out is go to systems and go to notifications options right here and then scroll down and go to additional settings right here where well, you can turn off these options according to your preference just just read what it says and just keep the options that you need and turn off all the options that you don't and the next option you can try out is inside settings go to apps right here and go to install apps and if you just have installed your windows 11 then there will be a lot of unnecessary apps that you need to clean up so there might be some of the unnecessary antivirus as well and some of the unnecessary apps which you can clean up and free up the storage just go to the three dot icon right here beside the app and click on uninstall which will make your windows 11 a bit faster the next option is go to apps again and then go to startup right here and you can turn all of these off and you can turn off all of these except for the windows defender make sure that you turn on the windows defender and others are not really necessary so so you can turn off the apps that are not needed during the time of startup make sure that you only have the windows defender option turned on or any of the antivirus software that you have installed in your desktop make sure that is turned on or else other can be turned off the next thing to keep in mind is to adjust the visual effects in your windows so in order to manage that hold on the windows key and hold on the so in order to manage that, hold on the Windows key and click on R. After this opens up, type sysdm.cpl and click on enter. After you do that, you're led to this page right here. Go to the advanced settings and go to the settings under performance and make sure that you toggle this option on. Adjust for best performance, right? Rather than any other options here. Make sure that you toggle this option right here and just enable the feature right here in these options according to your preference and after you're done with and after you're done with the management you can click on apply here and click on ok and that will make your windows a bit faster the next crucial measure that you can take is by disabling your game bar so in order to disable the game bar go to your settings and then go to gaming section right here click on it and go to xbox game bar and make sure that this xbox game bar option right here is toggled off if you do not play any games if you do play games then this is not really necessary and after you're done with that go to your search bar again and type for search Services. And after you let, and after this pop-up appears here, then what you can do is just disable unnecessary services that is provided to you. So, for example, one of the unnecessary services that is provided to you is download Maps Manager. So, if you're not using Maps, then this is not really necessary. You can just search the services around here that you don't need, and then right-click on the services, go to Properties, and make sure that you disable this option right here, right from the startup type. Make sure that you disable it. Another service that you don't need is Fax. I think if you're not using Fax, then why do you need it, right? so you can go to properties and disable it again other one is hyper v if you're not using virtual desktop feature in your pc then it's not really necessary so you can disable these options as well and the next options you can try out is click on windows plus r type temp click on enter can continue right here and after that all of these options are not really necessary so you can just delete all of these options by selecting all of them so this right here is the windows temporary folder so you don't really necessarily need these so you can just delete all of these by selecting all of these and after you're done with that hold on the windows key again and press r and type percentage temp and percentage again and click on ok 
and after you do that this right here is the user temporary folder so you don't necessarily need these as well so you can delete these as well which will make your pc faster those were some of the options that you can try out in order to optimize your windows 11 with faster performance hopefully you found this video helpful thank you very much those